Plus, the Denver man taking home entertainment to a whole new level. Well, if you are really into music, you probably have a top-of-the-line system with all your tunes ready to go from your iPod. But storytellers Nelson Garcia and Ann Herbst wondered, how about just having the band play in your living room for you and 40 of your closest friends? Tonight, something that is getting more popular around Colorado and the country. You are invited to a house concert. This is one I'm writing right now. Dwight Mark loves music so much. When he was looking for a home in the Highlands, he had just one key question. Can I fit 30, 40 chairs in this house? His love <laughs> prompts people to come over. Wow, more food. To see his living room transformed into a cozy Colorado Carnegie Hall about five times a year. I have to empty out the living room before a show and set up a stage and a sound system. There's a bit of work to it, but every time I have a show, there's something magical that happens. Oh, welcome to my home. How many people, uh, this is the first time here? Oh, wow. This is my Little Highlands House concert show. This show is the Matt Flinner Trio. The room's not that big, so yeah, they're pretty much in their face. Mark books concerts with different groups touring the country small groups looking for a different kind of venue. You feel like you're all there together, the audience and the band, and so you feel more connected, I think, to people. It's just a fun, intimate place to see a show. So far, this is Mark's 20th house concert. It just seems like a, a, a lot of close friends hanging out who really love playing or listening to music. And so far, the neighbors. I think they all think it's cool, I hope. <laughs> They know, they know I'm crazy, but for other reasons. <laughs> they have yet to complain. I've got double brick walls, and it's pretty much all acoustic, so you don't hear anything. It's not any louder than me watching a movie. This is not the kind of thing that's going to work for a band with amplifiers and drums. Oh! <laughs> but it is the kind of thing for bands also needing a place to relax and crash during their travels. <laughs> Nobody threw anything at us. Yeah, it's always a bonus. They can stay in the guest room and make themselves at home. And the food was good, too, so... <laughs> The price of admission for all this. You know, I, I make no money off of this whatsoever. I ask for donations to the artists, and all the money goes to the artists. Like I said, it's love. Yeah! And sometimes, the part-time musician gets to play with the full-time ones. After all, it is his house. Concert. As long as I can fill the seats and the people can, you know, keep the musicians happy. Absolutely, I would want to keep doing this. With photojournalist Ann Herbst. Nelson Garcia. Nine News. Thank you. How about that?